Our devotional today is from the first epistle to Timothy, chapter 2, verses 1 to 4. Therefore, I exhort first of all that supplications, prayers, intercessions, and giving of thanks be made for all men, for kings, and all who are in authority that we may lead a quiet and peaceful life in all godliness and reverence. For this is good and acceptable in the sight of God our Savior, who desires all men to be saved and to come to the knowledge of the truth. Amen. St. Paul in his first epistle to his disciple Timothy is urging us to pray and intercede continuously to everyone we know and to the men in authority. And he's drawing our attention that our prayers please our God and Savior Jesus Christ. These verses teach us that prayer has a very important and deeper purpose in our lives. It's not about asking God for a list of our needs, but it is a communication with Him. When we sit in His presence talking with Him, we know what the Spirit wants us to pray and intercede for. He shows us and makes us understand the will of God in many situations. We can hear His voice and know His purpose. Jesus called us to pray, as St. Paul wrote, all the time, because it's the time when we receive His enlightenment, strength, and power in the Holy Spirit. He knows what prayer does in us and for us. Prayer is a tool of connecting with Him. We must pray to be in connection with God's will and His power to fulfill His will in our lives. Amen.